Ever been yelled at by a flight attendant to turn off your device? No, airplane mode won't cut it. They need to be completely powered down and stowed during takeoff and landing. Some have questioned the necessity of this practice, like actor Alec Baldwin, who was famously thrown off an American Airlines flight for refusing to power down his game of words with friends, then launching into a cross-continental Twitter rant objecting to the restriction. Well, there are signs that airlines are loosening up on the rules that offended Alex so badly. Senator Claire McCaskill has asked the FAA to allow portable electronic devices other than cell phones for the full duration of the flight, pointing out that we don't really have a factual basis to support that they are a safety concern. On the blog Ask the Pilot, commercial pilot Patrick Smith admits that the rule isn't about electronic interference. It's about them becoming high-speed projectiles in the event of an impact. Either way, the FCC and the FAA claim to be studying the issue, and if common sense changes are not implemented, McCaskill says she will introduce a bill forcing them to loosen up on electronics. So, cool your jets, Baldwin. Looks like a change is going to come. And once you've reached full cruising altitude, of course, you can use Wi-Fi on some flights, and soon it could be getting a lot faster. Many airlines like Southwest and Virgin offer in-flight Wi-Fi, but it's expensive in many cases, slow, and not all that reliable. Engineers at Boeing are testing advanced Wi-Fi systems for use on planes, measuring stronger Wi-Fi signals that won't disrupt navigation or communication in the aircraft. How are they simulating a real-life flight? With sacks of potatoes standing in for people. The vegetables' interactions with radio wave signals mimic those of the human body. The perfect stand-in for people who would otherwise have had to sit motionless for days on end while data was gathered. The potato dummies are said to shorten testing times and eliminate the need to hire real people to sit on a plane for hours on end. So it's been confirmed that potatoes are the closest plant to human beings. But of course, we already knew that. Oh, look at that funny guy, Mr. Super, Mr. Potato Head. You can make a bunny potato head with me, Super, Mr. Potato Head. Now, be honest, have you ever secretly kept your device on during takeoff and landing? We promise we will not contact the authorities. This is Annie for TFN. Thanks for watching.